Good. I'm sure you'll need that weapon soon enough. Wait. I just noticed a teleportation tower was activated at Deadsville. Did Mary do that? Whoever it was, we can use it to teleport straight there. Open your map and try it out. Activating teleportation towers will let us get places much faster and avoid any dangers along the way. Good. You made it. Yeah, I figured this was the quickest way to bring you here. These towers are even supposed to let you travel between worlds, but I haven't been able to figure out how. Maybe you'll have more luck. Either way, I'm glad it got you here. Deadsville is the perfect place to dig up info on the area. That merchant over by the old truck looks like she gets around. Maybe she knows something useful. See anything you like. I'm always open for business. Wait, you're a mayfly, aren't you? Thank God, I could use some help. My name's Claire, Claire Lay. Normally I'm a wandering merchant, but now I'm stuck here. I sent a team over to a place called the Rotten Manor three days ago to collect some goods for me. But they never came back. Maybe they ran off with the goods. Don't be so cynical. I've been through thick and thin with them. They wouldn't do that to me. I'm afraid something must have happened to them. Rumor is the Rotten Manor's seen a surge of deviance recently. I suspect there's a deviation behind it. All I know is what I heard from that well-dressed gentleman over there. He should be able to tell you more. He definitely stands out. We better see what he knows. Good luck. Oh, and I'll happily pay a reward if you can recover my stuff for me. I'll mark the location of the Rotten Manor on your map for you. Just, uh, make sure to stock up on ammo before you go, all right? And know the place for the first time, through the unknown, unremembered gate. Ah, a mayfly. And one who seems to be brimming with potential. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. Do you know about a deviation affecting this area? You've come to the right man. I am Samuel Lowe, a humble scholar specializing in the fascinating phenomena we call deviations. And as for you, you seek keys with which to unlock the Dark Tower, don't you? But I'd be wary of what else you might open up. Do you always speak in riddles like this? I was merely setting the mood. Now, you're interested in the deviation inside that monolith, aren't you? But as I said, that tower is locked up tight, and its keys are rift anchors, scattered across the Dayton wetlands. Rift anchors? Those things are made by Rosetta, aren't they? Activating them should give us access to the rift space inside the monolith. Spot on. And where would these anchors be? Usually places with the heaviest stardust pollution. The Rotten Manor would definitely be one of them. Right again. I'm looking forward to seeing what you can do, Mayfly. And by the way, I wouldn't mind adding another deviation to my collection. In fact, I'd reward you handsomely for it. Now that we know what to do, 
Let's split up to cover more ground. I'll find a way to hack into the monolith. Once you've activated the rift anchors, come meet me at the monolith gate. Just don't forget to bring plenty of ammo. This won't be easy. Oh, and one more thing. I have a motorcycle here you can use. That should help speed things along. Oh yeah, this looks like it'll be fun to ride. Stardust's concentration here is off the charts. We should set up a campsite before rushing into the Rotten Manor. That way we can recover more quickly if anything goes wrong. Jail deviation.
I've noticed some other strange Stardust readings elsewhere. Quite similar to what we encounter here. I've marked their locations. Hopefully we'll find the other Rift Anchors there.